wrong one. We, like, uh... <laughs> all right, so I have to go play my match. Here's the PM bracket when we get there. Actually, I'm curious Wait, to who so I play. So this is PM. loser's final, right? I play Jarbod first. Uh oh, and then I play Con Man. Oh dear. I ha my Wait, end of the bracket is. Uh, you're playing. A you're playing crazy. Sean right now, aren't you? I am or? playing Sean. Oh uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, this is... Wait, this isn't right, is it? This, uh, this bracket you just popped open. Today, oh, okay, because I was going to say, Nick, ha Nick Hazard, I haven't seen him. Uh, okay. Ross, what's the name of this match? Oh, okay. So we are on loser semi semis. Yeah, that's right. And let me open the chat back up so just in case people are talking and stuff. Oh they oh they are talking. AK Tig AK Samus. Okay. Well, I'll call you. I'll call you something. <laughs> I didn't know it was a. Oh, you know. Ninty the Rage Kid just, you know, sometimes he's racist, but, you know, we've come to terms with that. <laughs> But this is uh this used to be a pretty bad matchup for Ross. He used to, you know, in P the PM days, uh, Marth was kind of his one of his Achilles heels. But he has gotten a lot better against him, so we will see. Especially when he decided he was going to try to learn some uh, melee, you pretty much have to be able to sort of handle a Marth. <laughs> oh yeah, that's yep, he's the curse of the Marth. <laughs> yeah, you know, I don't really know, uh, as a person that A, doesn't really play much against Marth because, you know, Ross doesn't play much Marth, and then, uh, you know, I don't play as him either, so I couldn't tell you that what the big differences are between him and Smash 4 and PM. I believe he's pretty similar. He's good at both, so. All also, I haven't been seeing Sean use, like, really any custom moves all day, so... But, you know, we're back to... back to normal. With, uh, no real big lead on from either side, so, yeah. Oh. There's some pretty cool cosplay going on, though. Like... Oh, this is sweet. <laughs> if if Ross wasn't uh, fighting a Marth right now, I'd totally show you.
<laughs> you know, I I'll let him know if he, uh, that he should definitely, uh, he should up smash some more. You know, when he's not busy, like, bamboozling Ross a little bit. Even though this is a very, very even match. Actually, Ross has a very, very small lead. So, we'll see. Ross has been training for this moment his entire life. <laughs> Danger zone. And the top's back out. Yep. Oh, and match. That's one for Ross. He conquered his, uh, his, uh, inability to beat Mars. Very close game, though. Ex up until that last stock. This will be interesting to see where they play. Oh, uh... PM should be, I mean, it was scheduled for 30 minutes ago, but uh, they should be playing it in about another half hour or so. Oh, oh yeah, it started, but, uh, like, people are actually playing it. We just haven't started streaming it because they haven't finished the finals of uh, Smash 4. So we're going to finish that up, and then we will... Uh, We'll probably start streaming like round two or so of PM. Oh yeah, my bad. Uh, sometimes like random zeros and ones get uh, get entered in there because uh, I use decimal point and zero to swap between uh, the position of uh, the camera, player cameras. So if my cursor is still in the program that updates our, uh, our player names and stuff, then it uh, sometimes puts those there. Got some journey playing on the background again. There is a, a fair amount of rock band being played. Oh, the claws going for Ross thinking about it. I do not know why this game, this is a uh, tournament legal map. Okay, it was a Oh yeah, that was, you know, that's the thing that can happen. Man, I cannot believe Pitt is still alive. Like, he really just has to be smashed right off the map. He cannot, uh... Oh! Ooh, that was scary. Uh, yeah, no, this, uh, tournament does have customs, or oh, weirdly enough. Uh, although... 
Ross and uh, Sean are not using them at the moment. Uh, but our last match, there was a lot of uh, between like plain yogurt and Mark, I believe. There were a lot of uh, custom moves used by plain yogurt. Yeah, I think there's a. Yeah, I I don't particularly care for customs, but I don't know. I feel like uh, if as long as the other player like sees what customs you're using before the match, that might uh, you know that might might be more fair. But when people just pull out random moves and don't know what you're using, that that can be a little unfair, I guess. And it's kind of difficult to memorize all the all the moveset combinations. Yeah, no, I agree. They're uh, they're kind of wacky. I mean, though, although Evo rules, which uh, this tournament's based on, they uh, they allow them, I guess. Uh, and, and we figure we just play with them until they're a problem, uh, more or less, just until they're banned. <laughs> with just a slight lead if he can pull this out of his, out his rump. He will have made it extremely far in this tournament. It's, it's because we all gave him our energy earlier, you know. This could work pretty well for Ross. If oh. Well, lasers can go through lasers, supposedly. Ooh. Although Sean Piaz really caught up, he, uh, he really closed the gap. Oh, oh no! Oh, yep. <laughs> Turning it to salt level level two there. No, yeah, that that's that's definitely some saltiness coming from Ross there. But uh, yeah, it was so close, and then it wasn't. So we got ourselves a tie game. <laughs> Ross needs some pizza. <laughs> Donkey Kong. Okay, so, oh, okay, so, uh, we'll see how this works out. I think this will give, uh, Ross a little bit of an advantage because there's so many moves he can use to just knock Pit out of the, out of the stage because he can't really knock Pit off the stage. And since Pit's gonna be pretty, pretty much up in the air a lot, it'll give him tons of times to use his, uh, his air move or his, uh, yeah, aerials. Man, there's some pretty tasty looking things being sold. Some pastries. Might have to grab me something. And we're perfectly ma- well, we were for a second there, we were perfectly matched. 
Yeah, that's because, uh, yeah, that's just because it, uh, isn't captured. It's not capturing the, the game, therefore, not the sound, but we might be able to add that in the future, just make, uh, the game in the very, very back and invisible. That way you can still hear it, hear it going on. I don't know, I feel like uh, on the amount of defensiveness there is in this game, there's some, some arguments to be made because uh, I feel like, or just me personally, as a person that is not a huge smasher, uh, I just feel like air dodges are way better. Like there are a few pretty, pretty good improvements to the, the whole defense situation. strong feeling that you would not lose a game if you played against me. No, you're good. And Ross just being his uh, airbender Donkey Kong. Oh, and that's what I was talking about. That's the kind of reasons why it's great that Ross switched to uh, Donkey Kong, because you really cannot just make Pit fall off the stage. Or at least not this bit. And there's Gam. Oh man. Poor, poor Ross. I can just... Victory! You can just see his, his soul fall out. And he's out of the game. Or Cam, I mean. But... Yep. Oh, so now we have we have Sean and plain yogurt. That 